Hey, this is Sam from Sure. In this video tutorial, I'll talk about monitor only mode, a utility that prevents inadvertent changes to devices by locking the user interface of Wireless Workbench 6. If you've ever used Wireless Workbench to control a live show or a corporate gig or something like this, you know that uh, the ability to monitor and control specifically parameters of any of your network devices is a huge convenience. But if Uncle Ben from the Spider-Man movies taught me anything, it's that great, uh, with great power comes great responsibility. By that I mean Wireless Workbench's ability to connect to any number of devices from anywhere on the network and make changes to those devices is a huge convenience when you want it to be, but it's also a liability. And by that I mean if there are other users or techs that are connected to the same network, they could be making changes when you want them to or not. And you yourself, if you've got a bunch of different things going on for a particular gig, it's more than easy to make a change to a parameter because everything is right on the surface. Um, and, you know, part of the value of Wireless Workbench is that we give you access to all of these device parameters. But uh, changing them when you want to is great, changing them when you don't want to isn't so great. So what we wanted to do was give uh, users the ability to lock down the user interface of Workbench from accepting changes to devices without upsetting or without removing any of the monitoring capabilities. And monitor only mode is a feature that does exactly that. So let me show you how it works. One thing I want to call attention to right now is this lock, this green lock icon in the bottom right hand corner. This is just a status indicator to say monitor only mode is disabled or the, the interface to wireless workbench is unlocked. So let's say during the configuration phase of my show I'm doing line checks and my talent is talking into the microphone and I can adjust the gain or make any other changes that I want to. Now we're ready for showtime and I want to lock down uh, my wireless workbench instance so that no more changes are received. If I go to the Tools menu and select Monitor Only, what that does is it locks the user interface down. I even get this little notification to say Monitor Only Mode is enabled. And you'll notice my green unlocked icon now turns to a yellow locked icon. So what this means is every place in the user interface where I could make changes to devices is now disabled. You'll notice I'm clicking and the gain doesn't change opening the properties panel, editing any of these properties, uh, all of these controls are disabled. And it isn't just in the monitor view. Uh, whether I want to take a scan with a device or adjust the zones or anything like that, any parameter that would have an impact to the operation of the device is locked. Now one thing that uh, doesn't prevent me from doing is monitoring things. So if I had a transmitter online, I would be able to use the channel strips, or I could use timeline to record channel status information. All monitoring functions work, including the discovery of new devices. It's just the control messages that are totally blocked from my version of Wireless Workbench. Now one thing I want to call out is that this monitor only mode lock is only affecting my version of my instance of wireless workbench. If I had a couple other technicians that didn't have this feature enabled, they would still be able to make controls. The same would go for uh, SurePlus channels, our iOS app, or any other applications that could be affecting wireless devices. Uh, the, you can think of this feature really more as a safety net against inadvertent changes from yourself or anybody else using your instance of wireless workbench. Now let's say the show goes uh, off without a hitch, no problems, and I'm ready to make some other changes or uh, wrap up my configuration for the day. I can simply go to Tools and turn off Monitor Only Mode. You'll notice my yellow icon turns back to green, and I can again make changes to my devices. So this is just to demonstrate that Monitor Only Mode is a great tool to prevent inadvertent changes from your own instance of Wireless Workbench. If you've got any questions or comments or you want to see more features about preventing inadvertent changes, be sure to leave a comment down below. Thanks.